What's up, guys? Uh, 14 weeks to go to the Michigan Roar. 16 weeks till Nabushai Town Showdown. Uh, I've been dieting for two weeks now. I started my diet at 180 pounds. Uh, again, just a little bit under 5'11. And I will hopefully be on stage somewhere between you know, 163 to 165. Um, last year I was on stage at 162, 163, so putting a couple pounds on in the off season of muscle, hopefully. Just, I'm killing it, will happen. My stage weight will be a little heavier. Um, but again, really not how much you weigh, it's how you look. So, um, dieting wise, these past two weeks, I've stuck to my macros. Um, which, you know, we talked about in my first vlog. Um, I'm gonna stick with those, you know, as long as the weight keeps coming off, don't need to change. Um, I'm doing no cardio. That is the question I probably get the most from people is like, how much cardio are you doing? And if you are on a diet where you are losing weight, you do not need to do cardio, especially if you are a natural competitor, because you don't want to risk the putting taking off any muscle that you've put on in the off season. If you're doing cardio, you're burning fat, you could also be burning muscle, and if you can get away with not doing cardio and still losing weight and getting shredded, you're going to be a lot more muscular than if you were doing cardio the whole time. Um, one of my preps, I did do cardio, um, and I came in and I looked so flat, and I even tried to carb up, and I just did, it, I looked like I looked, I looked like I lost a lot of muscle. So, not going to do that again. Um, at most, at most, I might do it once a week, but again, I'm at a job, I teach tennis full time, and a lot of people are surprised when they hear that. Played tennis in college, and you know, start coaching right out of college. And I have a bunch of kids that I teach that are just superstars. And it makes having a job not really a job. It's just it's just fun, and it's uh, you know it's a blessing. So um, yeah, when I graduated from college, I was like 145 pounds. I was skinny, fat. I had no muscle. I was just you know a skinny tennis player. And um, you know now. You know, off season I get to like 180 to 190. I mean, so much more <laughs> muscular and strong than I was, you know, back in college when I got out of college. Um, so, but I, dig I digress. So, cardio, none. Uh, you know, still rotating my low, moderate, and high carb days. And um, yeah, just just looking at the scale each week, making sure that I'm losing a pound or two pounds. And as long as that's happening. You know, I won't have to, I won't do any cardio. Um, and before I do cardio, I might even adjust my macros a little bit. You know, I might lower my carbs, lower my fats. Um, maybe, you know, adjust some of those just to try to tweak a little bit. And of course, I'm working with Kimmy Arnone on that because she's keeping me on point with, with where I need to be. Um, training wise, you know, I don't train different. I still am doing the same lifts. Um, you know, rotate exercises so you're not, you know, getting stagnant by doing the same exercise every week over and over again. Um, you know, if anything, I'll add an extra day of lifting. I mean, you know, it, people say, you know, you don't overtrain, don't train seven days a week or six days a week. You know, normally I train six days a week. Um, this weekend, I didn't take a day off. I didn't feel bad. I felt good. So, you know, my nervous system wasn't, wasn't too shot and I was like, okay, let's do this. So I, you know, I did a chest day Saturday, Sunday I should have took it, taken off, but I, I grabbed a workout with two of my buddies that, you know, really inspire me and they're young kids and they're young kids and they, uh, you know, they're hungry and, you know, they look up to me a little bit, which I love and, um, you know, had a blast with them lifting. So we, we killed some arms yesterday. Uh, I'll put up a picture, you know, later that from, from our workout. Cause you know, if you don't take a picture of your workout, it you know, never happened. Right. So. Um, so yeah, so training wise, everything's staying the same, diet wise, everything's staying the same, just status quo. Um, again, one to two pounds a week is a healthy amount to lose. If you're losing way more than that, be careful. If you're not losing enough, you might want to tweak your macros or possibly, um, look to, you know, integrate some cardio. Um, again, this is more for, for natural athletes. Um, but yeah, so uh, this week again, I'll keep posting some workout videos of, of my training. Um, we will do a food video again this week of, of, of one of the meals that I make while I prep. And um, probably some other fun stuff too. So, um, yep. 175, feeling pretty good. Um, we're going to test what my body fat is at the export today. I'm going to go in and do, do some back now. 
and uh, we're gonna use that machine you know you plug in all the buttons you hold it you know see what that says um, I'll talk about that next week in my vlog to see what that says I'm at at 175 I'm just curious um, last year when I was on stage at 163 164 it said I was at like 4.2 so I don't know how accurate that is but at least I got something to base it off of for uh, for comparison from last year so um, guys have a great week if you have any questions please comment under this video and I will get to them as, as soon as I can um, and you have a great week and kill it thank you again to my sponsors BPI sports uh, rocket fit uh, for apparel and uh, yeah have a great week all right let's do this you guys